Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. I'm glad to have you here. This video is going to be part one of two cleaning videos. In today's video, you'll see me clean my fridge, my downstairs, along with putting out my fall decoration and my kids clothing haul from Kohl's. I hope you guys enjoy and hopefully it will give you guys some motivation to get things done also. Now let's get started. So now I will be showing you how dirty and disgusting my fridge is. It has been quite some time before I last clean it. And let me tell you, the finishing project was awesome. Now you will see me talking to the camera. I was not going to do a voiceover, but I do have two kids and I don't think you want to hear um, them screaming and being loud. So I figured I will save you guys' ears. Also, you're going to see that later on in the video, I will not have this purple shirt on or this hat the day that I filmed in my fridge. That was the only thing that I did that day, and me and my family ended up just hanging out for the rest of the day. And then the next day after that is when I finished cleaning my downstairs and I did my fall decorations. Now I'm curious how often you guys like to clean your fridge. You should let me know down in the comments. Also, I'm excited to say that today when I go shopping, I'm going to go get me some pumpkin spice from Starbucks. Um, I went last week and they're like, oh, it's not going to come until next week. So I am excited. Yay.
So now you can see that it's raining and gloomy. I felt like it was just meant to be that way because that to the day that it was raining, it was the day that I did um, clean and decorate for fall. And I don't know about you, but when it's raining and gloomy, I feel like that is pretty close to wonderful fall weather. So I'm just looking at those amazing cookies and I was just curious as to what is your guys' favorite things to bake. I love baking cookies and brownies and I also love around the holidays when you bake the pies as well. But yeah, let me know what you guys love baking down in the comments. Alright, so who here loves to do laundry? I don't mind putting it in the washer and drying it. Sometimes I forget, but honestly, <laughs> I am the worst at taking it all the way upstairs and putting it away. Um, I do have a friend that has to have hers put away immediately. Um, I'm just curious as to what you guys like to do. Do you like to put it away immediately or you, like me where you just, you dread it and it just doesn't get done? Let me know down in the comments. All right, now on to my fall decorations. Some are old, some are new. Um, the pumpkin and the wreath are from a grad sale, my candles from Bath and Body Works. The pumpkin with the W on it is one of my favorites right now. It's just so adorable. And most of my other fall decorations and any of my hol or my um holiday decorations are from the Dollar Tree. I do love their decorations that they have. They are cheap and they are adorable. Let me know if you guys love shopping at the Dollar Tree as well. I do have a very small portion of fall decorations. Normally I like to put my fall and Halloween together, but I figured for now I'll just do my fall decorations for you guys. Let me know what you guys like to do in the comments, if you do like to do your fall and Halloween together or if you do like to do it separately. 
I am excited though to just have the pumpkins everywhere, the smelling of it, the warmth, the gratefulness. I'm just, I'm all excited about it. So let me know if you guys are as well. All right, guys, now I'm back into my kitchen, just tidying up after dinner. I did load the dishwasher, but I did not run it. There wasn't much in there to run, but I am just kind of going through and cleaning up the mess that way in the morning, I don't have to worry about a messy kitchen. And throughout the video or at the end of the video, you will see me coming back into the kitchen to sweep and mop it. Alrighty, now it's a few hours later. My kiddos are in bed. I figured after they went to bed, I wanted to come downstairs and clean underneath both of our chairs and our couch. And I also wanted to go through and sweep and mop. That way, when we came down in the morning, we came down to a nice clean area. Let me know if you guys like to clean before you guys go to bed. I will be honest, I don't do it all the time, but sometimes when I'm in that mood, I do like to get it done that way in the morning. You know, it's stress-free and you can just enjoy your morning. Let me know if you made it this far in the video. If you have, thank you for watching. Um, but I am just curious if you haven't made it this far, what is your absolute favorite holiday? Um, I go back and forth between fall and Christmas, but I do love almost every holiday that there is out there. But let me know down in the comments, what one is your absolute favorite? You guys are probably curious as to why we have oxygen tanks in our house. My husband does have cluster headaches and oxygen is one relief, but I will say that um, before I moved the chairs back, I ended up moving the oxygen tanks and cleaning under there as well. That is the area our kids like to eat and <laughs> it does get messy over there. So I did decide to move it and clean it as well.
I will admit I am terrible at doing a before and after. I do like to go through after and show you guys everything, but I will promise I will work on doing a before. That way I feel like it's more satisfying to see a disaster turn into a nice, beautiful, clean area. Also, let me know if I'm the only one that does this, but I am showing you guys the areas that our fall decorations are in. I don't know about you, but sometimes I will put it there and then either my kids will mess with them or I will end up moving them because I didn't like the spot that they were in or I would get more items and, you know, place them randomly too. But let me know if you guys do the same or if you guys just leave it alone once you put it out. Alrighty, now we're into the clothing haul for my kids' at school. Um, all of this is from Kohl's. I have a preschooler who's only going two half days. And then I also have a first grader. I'm super excited that both of my kids are in school and sad all at the same time. I do like to get them short sleeve and long sleeve shirts. We do live up north, so it does get pretty chilly. Um, I did get them some nice clothing as well for picture day and um, holidays. It is the beginning of the school year, so I do like to get them clothing and shoes and new backpacks and school supplies as well. I haven't gotten them their school supplies yet. Today we plan on going and getting them, so maybe um, I might hold off on posting this video so that way I can give you a little haul on their school supplies as well. But both of my kids are super excited to go back to school and I'm just excited to see them grow and learn and it's just amazing watching your kids grow. <music> I'm also curious um, my son has to have two sets of shoes one for gym and one for their daily schooling um, let me know if your guys kids are doing the same I only have a first grader and a preschooler so I'm still in the early stages of school um, but yeah I'm just curious if you guys gotta do that as well guys thank you so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed and if you did don't forget i'm going to be doing a part two of the rest of my house i won't be decorating it but i will be cleaning it um let me know if you guys already decorated have decorated i would like to know get to know you guys i hope you guys all enjoyed and if you did like please like and subscribe and i hope you guys all have a great day thank you for watching bye